Do your PowerPoint presentations look as engaging as they could be? In this video, I'm going to reveal a step-by-step -step guide to creating stunning infographic slides in PowerPoint that will captivate your audience. Most presenters miss out on these easy design tips that can make a huge difference in the impact of their slides. My name is Momo with Fast PPT, and as a seasoned PowerPoint designer, I'm excited to share the best techniques I've honed over the years to help you elevate your presentations and impress your viewers. Make sure you stay till the end to see the magic happen. Step one, let's create some basic visuals using shapes. We're gonna start by inserting an arrow shape from the block arrows section. And next, we're going to add a rounded single corner rectangle and adjust its height to match the arrow shape. We're going to select both shapes by holding down the command key and then right clicking, and then open format object and set the transparency to around 30% for a little bit easier adjustment. Step two, we are going to improve the layout of the visuals now. We're going to flip the rounded single corner rectangle horizontally and slightly round its corners. And then we're going to go to shape options. We're gonna click the weight and width icon and rotate the shape to 300 degrees. We're gonna position both shapes accordingly and then insert a triangle shape. We're gonna remove its outline. Then we're gonna increase the transparency and rotate it 180 degrees this time. We're going to adjust the triangle by right clicking and selecting edit points. Then we're going to drag and adjust the points to create a perfect circular arc. Once aligned and adjusted, we're going to select the triangle and arrow shapes. We're going to go to shape format and then we're going to choose union to combine them. Then we're gonna set the transparency back to zero and then group them together. We're gonna to duplicate the group shapes using command and D and rotate the duplicate 120 degrees and then place it on the top left, making sure it's overlapping the original. We're gonna duplicate once more and rotate this new shape 240 degrees. And this is going to create a new triangle shape with arrows. Step three, we're gonna refine the slide and put some final touches in. We're gonna fill each arrow shape with different colors, green for the first, blue for the second, and dark blue for the third. And we're going to apply gradient fills to the rounded single corner shapes beneath each arrow. We're gonna do a blue dark gradient for the shape under the blue arrow. Then we're gonna do a darker blue black gradient for the shape under the dark blue arrow and a green black gradient for the shape under the green arrow. Then we're gonna send the green shape to the back for a 3D gradient look. And finally, we're going to add icons and titles and fill the icons with white and then arrange all the titles and text to complete our design. And that's a wrap on transforming your shapes into a stunning 3D design. If you enjoyed this tutorial and you wanna see more creative ways to enhance your PowerPoint presentations, do not miss out on our previous videos where we explore things like the dynamic transitions, animations, that'll make your slides stand out even more. Click the link to watch it next and keep your presentations looking sharp and engaging. We'll see you next time.